Hey guys, my name is Dave, and welcome to another video. Now, something's been kind of rolling through my head as of today. It's kind of random, but I've been thinking a lot about morals and ethics. Now, I have, to, I have talked about morals and ethics a lot on this channel as of now, but... If I were to talk about directly how uh, what I feel morals and ethics actually are, in a sense of how, like how you should approach them, I guess that kind of I, I guess I haven't talked about it yet, just because I feel like it might make things seem like they're contradictive to my ideals that involve these. But let's not hold it off anymore. Let's go ahead and talk about that now. Morals and ethics, what are they? Well, for one, I'll talk about them individually. They're very similar. Morals, bear in mind, just to show off the slight difference in the two, morals are what your mindset creates to set a path for you in your own beliefs. Ethics are similar, but they're directed towards very specific topics, like a job or when you're eating, or school. So, to start a bit loosely, let's start by discussing morals. What do I think morals are very specifically? Morals, I personally believe, are a guideline. A guideline that you create yourself. Now, the reason I say guideline is because people make morals. Everyone does, including myself. And having seen, heard from others, and experiencing from my own personal, well, duh, experiences, I would say that not every guideline is followed down to the dot, or not every guideline is followed all the time. I think personally that this is exactly how morals are treated and pretty much what morals are. Morals are guidelines in the sense where, you know, we all make them for ourselves based off our own personalities. But we don't always follow our own morals. Take me for example. A moral that I have, um, is, and this is going to be uncircumstantial and unbelievable to a degree, my a moral that I've been trying to build up recently is that to keep a variety of wording rather than cussing all the time. I have cussed, yes, not even going to deny that, but... The idea of the moral, the reason I say not all the time, is because I know for a fact that every now and then if I hit a certain level of mindset, it will happen. Am I usually happy about it afterwards? Absolutely not. That's not even a question for me. I'm never happy with myself after the fact. But there's not much else I could do about the matter outside of saying, you know what? I did it. It doesn't go against, it doesn't make me feel guilt of any kind, because there are certain degrees of this moral that I feel like, and this is where kind of morals hit their ground hard. Some you have to follow to the dot, others are kind of loosely based. That's like the large difference between morals and ethics. Now again, back to me, when I say loosely based, it's the cussing thing. However, on the topic of words, there are some words that I refuse based off of my morals to say regardless. And this is kind of the point of morals where you can not. This is the level of it where you have the mindset of, I will not break this moral. I will not go against it. Many people who are of specific religions uh, refuse to say or do specific things. It's an add-on to kind of like their beliefs, but their morals as well, depending on the person. But as for me, and the wording... The N-word. 
sometimes even words like like words words that are extremely offensive anywhere now sometimes you'll find me saying words that aren't well known to be offensive if i'm unaware of words being offensive like publicly yeah i'll say them but you'll still find me saying them very loosely and not often but then there are words like again the n-word regardless of whether it's the rap version or the you know the version that's actually considered everywhere to be extremely offensive where you say it, you get punched i will refuse to say that because that's what i've been taught i mean that's what i believe i believe it's just horrible to say something that is publicly well known to not say and I won't say stuff like that. That's that's kind of where I think morals for like morals stand. They're loose but stern, depending on the moral. They're kind of a mix of both. But then there are ethics where you hit ground point. That's all you got. You don't have any loose standards. All of it is just firm belief, firm you got to do this and once you do it you're stuck with it. Let's go with work ethics for example. For me, I go to work Whatever I'm working on, I will finish. I will never do anything half-asked. Ever. You will never see a job half-done by me. Maybe if you rewind far back enough before I had built up my own morals, that would be the case. But now that I have a strict set of morals, strict, strict set of ethics, you will never find a job half-done by me. And if it is half done, it's probably just because I'm leaving it off for a bit, taking a break, and then getting back to it within a time space of maybe like an hour or so at the very most. Dinner ethics. Me personally, if you see me with my mouth open, I can guarantee almost all the time, if not all the time, in fact, nowadays, all the time, unless requested otherwise, which is weird, but... You will never find me talking with food in my mouth. And if you hear me burp or hear anything like that, it is unintentional. Personally, I just find that disgusting. If it's intentionally done, it's just downright disgusting. But these are kind of where, like, the diff These examples presented, in case there's not a direct noticeable difference between ethics and I forget the word somehow poop if there's not a difference between morals and ethics noticeable then let me lay it out morals are a bit loose if you break some of them it's not that big a deal there are some that you want to keep consistently kept firm, but others, if you break them, yeah, it's no big deal. Ethics, it doesn't matter what angle you look at, you harm any kind of part of your ethics once, and it could drastically alter something. It could do bad for you. That's how I see it, at least. I don't know. What do you guys think? Do you guys have any different ideas about how to approach, like, how would you guys define ethics and morals? And if they're different, how to you? If they're the same, that's fine. Either way around, let me know in the comments below. Um, but if you did like this video, make sure to push that like button and so far you can't see it anymore. If you really liked it, consider subscribing to the channel. Have a suggestion for a topic you'd like me to talk about, let me know in the comments below. Like to check out any other things that we've discussed on this channel, or ranted about? Why not click the link on the side of my head? Um, does, if that doesn't suit you quite a bit, check out the link on the other side where YouTube will give you, you know, something that it thinks you might enjoy, and check that out. Neither really float in your boat? Check out the channel itself, maybe you'll find something there. In the meantime though, I'm gonna head off. Thank you guys so much once again for watching this video, and I hope to see all of you in another one. Bye for now.